So finding a comfortable position to sit in, you could be sitting on a chair, feet on the ground, or coming into a cross-legged position on a cushion, or perhaps even kneeling with a meditation stool. If you feel very tired, it's fine just to lie down, but try and maybe prop yourself up with a few, a few cushions. Find a position where you can remain mindful, aware, relax, but not to the point of falling asleep. just going to explore a couple of mindfulness exercises and practices to bring integration into our emotional field, our energy field. But let's first just connect to the body, which of course is often the very ground of our mindfulness, noticing what's happening within your body, noticing how your body feels, if it feels tired, full of energy, heavy or light, just noticing with a sense of acceptance of your present moment experience. Noticing any strong sensations within the body, any strong currents of energy moving through the body. Where I live today, it's very windy outside. And sometimes you might just feel these almost winds or currents of energy moving through your body, like a gust of wind. Just allow yourself the sense and the permission to be held by the earth. Allow the sense of being supported into your experience. use this meditation now to explore a couple of practices that you can do in your daily life, not only within this kind of more formal meditation, but integrate them into your life. So the first thing is just to explore a couple of themes that you can use in the days ahead as focuses for your mindfulness. So just connecting to your own intuitive awareness. And allow your body and mind and spirit to speak. Do you feel that you're being prompted to pay attention to any specific things in your life over the days ahead?
It may be in relation to yourself. It could also be in relation to others, a loved one, partner, close friend. Just a way of relating to others. Could be something to do with your posture, the way that you communicate. Could be as simple as the way you walk from one room into another. When you begin to have a few themes, just sit with them for a while. Maybe having a, don't make it too complicated, but just making space for that sense of curiosity that you've chosen those things that have emerged within your consciousness at this time. And seek just to commit to a few of them. And allow them to rest on the level of your heart center. Your heart will help you to remember. Just to focus on these things as a simple aspect of your mindfulness. Every few days you might just want to come back into another short reflection meditation like this just to see what's moving within you as these little focuses for your attention. Because awareness, mindfulness of course is always with us. It's just a sense of tuning in to them, but it's so wonderful to be able to connect what we do, of course, what we do within, within our meditations like this and our wider life. Because of course our wider life in many ways is the ground of our practice. The stage, the theatre where it all gets played out. Now just tuning back into the body, noticing how the body feels. Just allowing the breath to be steady, free, open. And 
now I just want to offer a little technique that I do sometimes. And this technique is particularly good if you're doing something practical like walking or driving. And you're just tuning in to your, again, tuning in to your psyche, body, mind, spirit. And just noticing what words want to come up that can become your mini mantra that you can say to yourself and don't edit it too much. And whatever words come through to you, just begin to repeat them out loud at first. And just having a sense of trust that the words that come are the words that are useful for you to say to yourself at this time. And whatever words that come, you can just repeat them again and again, like a little mini mantra. And when you do that, just try to give a sense of awareness, noticing, witnessing, openness to a kind of magical alchemy from saying this little energetic incantation. Hopefully saying these words, whatever ones have come through to you, will just help to loosen a few of the psychic knots that may be at work within you at the moment, just opening things up, addressing things in a meaningful way. addressing things in a playful but meaningful way. And after you've said them out loud for a time, it can be nice just to say them in silence to yourself. You might find that every time you do this little exercise, different words come through to you and that's completely fine because different words, of course, can be useful at different times of our life, depending on our mood, our mental state, etc. Okay, so in this med short meditation so far, we've explored choosing many focuses for mindfulness that we can apply in our daily life. And also a little technique of how to unlock little potent phrases or words that can just help us through our day and nudge us back into a state of balance, integration, awareness. So if you feel inspired, just taking those practices with you into your daily life. You can always come over to our Facebook group. I'll leave a link at the bottom of this video to let others know how you've got on with these practices. Once again, finally, just coming back to your body, grounding, noticing 
having an awareness that we're going to bring this short reflection, contemplation, meditation to an end. Allowing yourself to rest in silence for a few moments. Before bringing some movement back to the body, moving fingers and toes. And when you're ready, slowly opening your eyes.